Hey guys, what's up? This is the Matrix uh, screensaver, and that's all it's called, Matrix screensaver. The second one I'm going to show you is called the Matrix code emulator screensaver. Uh, boy, that is cool. Green keyboard, green computer. Awesome. And you can change the colors on the computer, but um, trust me, I didn't customize just for the screensaver. And you can make it say your name. Wake up, baby bird. Uh oh, Morpheus is out to get me. Anyway, this part of the screensaver is called uh, Trace, and you can disable it to get to the real symbols. And. Oh, there we go. And it is just generating some. Uh, crap over here. I have no idea what it's doing. Anyway, um, I like to just disable this part of the screensaver and just go straight to that. You can just press escape and it'll go to the coding which is really 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 cool. So, green computer, green code. Wow, this is awesome. And I will teach you guys how to install it because it comes with some other programs and it kind of tricks you into uh, accepting it into your computer so I'm gonna make sure you don't do that and you just get only the screensaver now let me show you the second screensaver this one is called matrix code emulator the first one was called the matrix preview and it just goes straight to that now there are settings in the screensaver where you can change the speed, you can change the the amount of uh, symbols, you can change uh, all kinds of stuff. And enough showing off the screensavers, I'm going to teach you how to install them now. Now for the second part of this video, I am going to teach you how to install it so you don't get all this adware and it'll be nice and clean on your computer. Um, okay, so just to make this easy, uh, I have both the links on the bottom of my video in the description. And you can just go to Google and just type in the matrix. Can't type. Screensaver. And you will see two links from CNET. One says code emulator, that was the second one I showed you, and the first one says just a matrix screensaver, which is the first one I showed you. Um, so we are going to install either one. Um, let's install the first one first. And you're going to click download now. You're going to click save file. And it will tell you that you have downloaded it. So you open that, click run. You're going to see this, and then you just will click next step because that is what we are just downloading is the matrix executable. And you are going to click custom setup, and you are going to uncheck these both. And that is what I was telling you that they try to install all this other crap in your computer. So you click custom install, uncheck both of them, click next step, and you're going to see this. And it makes it look like you are accepting the terms of use for the matrix screensaver, but this is just actually another program called Great Arcade Hits, which is basically just uh, adware, and you are just going to decline, and you are going to decline again, and then it will say it is downloading, and uh, you can install now. And uh, since I already have it, I'm not going to install now, so I'll just say later. And there you go, that's how you install it. And it works both ways. Um, I'm sorry, not both uh, It works for both the screensavers. It's the same exact thing. You just decline those offers. And um, I also want to show you how to use them. So you will go to screen. I'm sorry, you go to personalize screensaver 
and the first one is called the matrix like I said five times already the second one is called matrix code emulator and you can adjust the settings here you can make it change your resolution since I have three screens I use 5760 and uh, for the matrix one I you gotta click settings over here and you can make it uh, with the trace program that I showed you in the first one at the beginning of the video those but that binary code you saw you can change that you can change your name you can also um, change colors I believe on the matrix code emulator one okay so if you want to uninstall these programs you go to your control panel uninstall a program and you will see that it says matrix code emulator and you will see that it says matrix uh, screensaver version blah 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 uh, if for some reason you cannot find them in your uh, control panel you can always go to your disk your main disk or your C drive go to Windows and type in dot S C R matrix and you will see that comes up the matrix code emulator and you can open file location and delete it from there uh, these three actually uh, that is just the problem with the second one uh, the second link the matrix code emulator sometimes you don't see it in the control panel so you gotta do it that way um, the first one I haven't had a problem you, you will see it but if for some reason the, the second one doesn't appear in your programs or features um, you could just reinstall it and it'll appear and remember to decline those offers we spoke about um, and always click customize and uncheck those two toolbars and that's it guys I hope you enjoy it and I've had it for a while I have it does not come in my virus scanner as a virus I have two virus scanners and it is awesome so take care guys